want families to be able to get the help that they need for their children and so that they can have the best life that they possibly can and not worry like, can I financially afford it? One Penticton mom has started a petition hoping to see better dental coverage from the federal government after finding out that her seven-year-old daughter's cleft surgeries that were dental costs weren't covered by medical care. Just from my own experience personally, it's, it's already a very stressful uh, thing as a parent to have to go through as, it, as is like any other surgery or, you know, type of thing that you have to deal with with your child when it comes to your children. You only want what's best for them and your main focus is your child and it's just, it's so much harder when you have that upcoming surgeries and appointments and back-to-back -back dentist and, you know, doctors and then on top of it you have to worry like, do I have enough to financially afford for her to get what she actually needs? And that really is like something that just is sad. The parliamentary floor will be discussing dental care, a push that the NDP government would like to see introduced in Canada's health care plan. I mean, that's where I think the system is very unfair. When we, you know, it's, it's so frustrating. Canadians think we have the, the greatest health coverage in the world, and yet we don't cover things like dental care. They kind of say is if you have extended dental that that'll help um but you know i know that there's lots of families out there that don't have extended dental and in our case we've already used most of what we have for her extended dental already so you know that's the only real thing like nobody's really tried to say much about it there's kind of nothing that they can do i don't think Cannings estimates after a discussion with the Parliamentary Budget Office that it would cost around $1 billion a year to add dental. And we can easily pay for that with proper uh, taxation. We would easily be able to, to cover these people. And as I say, we would also be saving hundreds of millions of dollars because people wouldn't have to go to emergency. They wouldn't have to go to their doctor uh, as often. A lot of these other families that I did talk to weren't aware either that there are going to be dental fees down the road. So we started this petition in hopes that eventually maybe somewhere higher up will hear about it and be able to change the coverage on the dental plans for children with clefts and get it completely covered for them just like the medical side of it so that these families aren't left with this financial burden that could potentially go into the thousands. Morecambe hopes to bring awareness to others on this issue and have other parents see their children with cleft issues looked after. For Castanet News in Penticton, I'm Casey Richardson. With my husband and I dealing with um, Adriana's dental work, um, 